Hello everyone, welcome to General Education. Today we're going to discuss about compound interest. In the first question, we have principal is 19200 rate is 12.5% per annum time is 2 years, find compound interest here. In compound interest, we have amount equal to principal plus 1 plus R by 100 all time. For compound interest, we have amount minus P, that is P1 plus R by 100 all time minus P. This is the formula for obtaining compound interest, but in this video, I will not use any of these formulas. So, and uh, but I will be using ratio method. That is, for red, we have here uh, 12.5 percent. That is one by eight. In the in the previous class, I've I've calculated uh, some simple interest on red on ratio ratio method. It is 12.5 percent go to one by eight. So this one is interest and eight is principal. But in compound interest case. Uh, it will be different. Compound interest is 12.5 percent equal to one by eight. We know that compound interest is calculated upon uh, amount, but in compound uh, simple interest it is calculated upon interest. So in compound interest we have this nine by eight. This nine is amount and this eight is principal. So uh, here in simple interest we have one by eight for two years. Simple interest for two years, this is two by eight. This two is simple interest for two years, and this uh, eight is principal. But in the case of compound interest, well, we will be taking square. That is nine by eight whole square. That is eighty one by sixty four. So the difference. This is this is the amount, and this one is the principal. The difference between the amount and principal will be the compound interest. That is eighty one minus sixty four is. Seven one. So in the uh, in the question, it is given the principal sixty four unit is correspond to one nine two zero zero. This is sixty four into three zero zero. So seven seventeen unit. This compound interest will be zero zero. This is seventeen three zero five one zero zero. So option uh, B. So correct answer. In the next question, we have. Principal is 8,000 rates, 5% per annum time, 1 year, 6 months, fine compound interest. In this type of question, I'm going to introduce a new method, that is 3 method here. We have principal, we have interest here, we have interest here, we have interest here. Here, this is going to be the simple interest for first year, this is going to be the second year, simple interest. But for compound, this, this this two is for two years simple interest, simple interest. But for compound compound interest, the, it will be all this one because in compound interest we know that now uh, we calculate interest two times. So for this principal x, this one will be the interest, and in the next year this interest will be the principal again, and this one will be the interest. So this is how I'm saying this one is. Uh, this two is for uh, compound interest. So here we have. Let me clear this. Our principal is eight thousand here, and red is five percent. This five percent is one by twenty here. One by twenty. One by twenty of eighty thousand is four hundred twenty. For the eight day, that is four hundred, and then one by twenty here, four hundred, and then again interest for second years uh, compound interest is one by twenty, that is twenty here, <coughs> twenty here. The question is saying find the uh, find the compound interest for one year, twelve month, for one year, uh, six months here uh, here in the first. In the first year, the compound interest is 400. And in the second year, we have 400 plus 20 is 420. This is going to be the two years compound interest. But uh, the question is asking not two years, it is one year, six months. So this is going to be divided into 12 parts. This is monthly, and we're multiplying six because we need six months. This is six. 2 is a 12, this is 2, 2 is a 4, 2, 1 is a 2. Therefore, the compound interest for six uh, for one year and six months is 
four zero zero plus two one zero this is six one zero option d is our correct answer in the next question we have the difference between the compound interest and simple interest for two years is rupees 50 50 uh, rate is 12.5 percent per annum the capital is what so i will i will use the three method again here this one is the principal we do not know the principal we have interest here interest and the second interest here here the question is red equal to 12.5 percent that is one by eight here one by eight here one by eight one by eight here let me assume this one as interest and this p is principal uh, this eight is principal so this one is interest and this one is principal principal is eight here for in this case i will consider this one is uh, in uh, interest and this one is principal and we know that this one is princ uh, interest for this principal so if this if this one is corresponding to eight that is uh, multiplied by eight eight times then here this one will be multiplied again by eight eight is 64 yeah we know that this is the principal and this one is the interest here in the principal we have eight here in the principal we have 64 this eight unit is correspond to 64 that is into eight eight is 64 then we have this interest one that is to eight again this is eight so the difference between compound interest and simple interest for two years is this one unit will be the difference for compound interest for two years and simple interest for two years this one unit is rupees 50 then the principal that is 64 unit is 50 5 for the 20 5 6 uh, 30 32 3200 is our principal this is option c in the next question we have if the amount of second year compound interest is rupees 630 and a rate of 16 point 16 uh, 2 by 3 percent per annum for two years find the principal here yeah. uh, 16 point 16 whole 2 by 3 percent is equal to 16.67 percent this is 1 by 6 here yeah. let me use the three method here again principal this is rare interest interest 1 by 6 one by six this one by six this is interest this is interest so this one is one this is principal so this one six we know that this one is interest and this one is interest interest for this principal so if one unit is uh, six then or multiply by six then this principal will be six six uh, thirty six here in this side we know that this one is principal and this 36 is principal so how many times is this one 6 6 are 36 then this interest this one unit of interest will be 6 times 6 6 are uh, 1 6 to 6 here uh, in the, the question is saying the amount of second year compound interest is 630 that is the second year compound interest will be this six this six and one this six and one that is seven if seven gives will be six three zero then seven one is seven seven nine is sixty three ninety then the principal that is thirty six will be to ninety nine six uh, fifty four five and a half five nine three is seven thirty two zero 320 3240 is our principal that is option a in the next question we have a sum of money is rupees 10,000 a sum of money rupees 10,000 is lent out for the first year is a 4% and for the second year 5% per annum the compound interest for two years is here uh, rupees we have principal rupees 10,000 then in the first year the rate is four percent in the second year the rate is five percent we know that four percent is equal to one by twenty and 
for compound interest calculation it is calculated upon amount so 21 by 20 also in this case for 5% 5% is 1 by 20 no this 4% is 1 by 25 I'm sorry this 1 by 25 so when in compound interest it is calculated upon amount so 26 by 25 this is amount and this one is principal here 5 percent is 1 by 20 so in amount compound interest amount is 21 and principal is 20 these two should be multiplied together here so 26 by 25 and 21 by 20 this is 26 into 21 that is 26 to 6 to 12 to 2 to 4 5 it is six four five or two five four six twenty five to the fifty zero and the compound interest is forty six so this five hundred is principal principal is given rupees ten thousand is five hundred into two is one thousand twenty that is forty two into twenty is two six the twelve two for the eight nine nine two zero is our uh, compound interest for two years in the uh, for second year no for two years how, how why how am i doing like this because in the compound interest calculation we have amount and uh, if red is for two different year red is r1 is for the first year and r2 is for the second year then amount equal to principal one plus r1 by 100 for well, R plus R2 that is for second year or oh, divided by 100 by oh, whole so we have principal is now I have said this principal 1 plus R is 4% 4 by 100 into 1 by 1 plus for R2 is 5% that's why I'm getting P 26 25 21 20 this is how i get this i want to do a shortcut so i'm doing like this in the uh, in my calculation here yeah i'm doing like this so guys please don't confuse in the next calculation i'll be using such type of question such type of method so in the next question we have if the rate of compound interest is for for fast series rupees uh, 11.11% and for the second year the red compound is 14.28% uh, per annum the difference between the compound interest and the supply interest for two years is 60 here I'm going I'll be using the three method here uh, again the uh, first year red one is 11.11% that is 1 by 9 again red 2 is 12.2% 8% is equal to 1 by 7 here in this type of question we have principal principal that is r1 r2 r2 so i'll be using this formula here principal is unknown this is for r1 is 1 by 9 r2 is 1 by 7 R2 is 1 by 7. Here, I'll be, I will be taking uh, uh, interest as 1 and the principal is 7. Again, for here, if 1 interest is 7, it is into 7, then this 9, this principal will be into 7, that is 9, 7, 63. This is principal and this 7 is also principal. So, how many times is uh, 63? Uh, into 9 7 9 63 so this interest one will also get into 9 this is 9 therefore the question is saying the difference between the compound interest and simple interest for two years is rupees 60 so this one unit is the difference between the compound interest and simple interest for two years that is rupees 60 that is into 60 we have uh the sum the principal is 63 into 60 this is 6 3 18 6 is 36 37 0 3 7 8 0 is our answer that is option c
so guys if uh, if you like this uh, video please like uh, subscribe and share thank you